Hey, Women Post artists, I wanted to show you today how to animate your pixel art drawings. So first go to the pixel art website and make sure you log in using your Google account. And once you get to your gallery page, you may have to load one of your previously made images. I'm going to select my goldfish here and then edit so I can continue working on it. Now remember that animations are a sequence of drawings put into order. Um, they were played in sequence so you can see movement. Now when you're creating your picture, make sure that you are using layers. You can see over on the right hand side here, I have my layers. You can uncheck them or uncheck or check or uncheck them with the little box next to it. And that gives you a lot more control over movement. So I can move my fish. Now if I decide I want my fish to go behind my plant, I can push the layer down. And now you can see it is behind my plant. Now I want to have my fish swim across the screen. So what I'm going to do is we're going to create a bunch of frames. So if I click on the preview of the frames here, you can see I have my first frame. Get this out of the way. You can lock this over on the right hand side behind the locked frame panel that will keep this up and above. I'll make this full screen so I have all the extra stuff. Now, my first frame, instead of redrawing it, I'm going to hit Copy Frame. And that creates a duplicate. Now, I'm going to use the Move tool, which is over here, and just move my fish a little bit. You don't want to move very quickly. Just move it a small amount. I'm going to copy the frame again, then move it again. Copy, and move it again. Now, right now, I don't have my fins moving or anything like that. I'm just doing a really simple animation. And I'll just take it right off the side of the paper just by repeating that process over and over. Copy. Now, just if you do take your object off of the page, it pretty much deletes it off. So if I were to bring it back on, my fish has been pretty much cut in half. And then I'll take my last frame, I'll just hide it. I'll probably have to remake it anyway if I want to use it or go back to a previous frame. All right, so now it's off the page. You can hit preview at any time to see your animation. Now, if you don't like how fast it's going, you can change the frame speed. The higher the number is, like the smaller it is, the faster it goes. So right now I have it set at 100. So I'm going to set it at 250 and we can preview it a little bit better now. Now you can go back into your frames. Let's say I wanted to sit here for a little bit. I'm just going to put it to here to maybe 300. It's going to stay a little bit longer. And I want to add some frames in there. I want to have the fish look around. So you can change that. I'll just move the eye a little bit, redraw it. And I'll take it, my pencil, and I'll copy it again. I'm going to decrease the time, copy. I can set it, there we go. And now I can just use my arrows if I want to. So let's see, it looks around a little bit. And then you can preview, move on. Um, once you are all finished, I will be showing you next class how to turn in your pixel animations, just make sure you always save your drawing. If you've already saved it once, it's going to ask if you want to update it. But if you don't save it, it won't save. So make sure that you don't lose out on your hard work. All right. I hope you guys are doing well with your animations and we'll continue with these next class.